is peak not launching, crashing on startup, or freezing right after you click play. Whether you're using Steam, Epic Games, or standalone install, these issues are common in Unity-based games and can be fixed with the steps shown in this video. Watch the full guide to troubleshoot and fix peak launch problems, black screens or crashes to desktop. First, open Steam. Head over to your library and locate Peak. Right-click it and select Properties. Go to the Installed Files tab. Click Verify Integrity of Game Files. This will scan your game installation and replace any missing or corrupted files. Wait for the process to finish, then try launching the game. Solution 2. Again, right-click Peak in your Steam library and select Manage. Click Browse Local Files to open the game folder. Find peak.exe, right-click it, and select Properties. Go to the Compatibility tab. Check Run this program as administrator. Also check Disable Full Screen Optimizations. Click Apply, then OK. Now try launching the game again. Solution 3. Open your Start menu and type Device Manager. Open Device Manager. Expand Display Adapters. Right-click your graphics card, then select Update Driver. Choose Search Automatically for Drivers. Wait for Windows to check and install any updates. Solution 4. If you're using an NVIDIA GPU, open your Start menu and type NVIDIA App. Launch the app and go to the Drivers tab. Click Check for Updates and install any available updates. This ensures your game has the latest optimizations and bug fixes. Solution 5. Go back to Steam, right-click Peak, and select Properties. Find the Launch Options section. Paste the custom launch command provided in the description of this video. Close the window and launch the game. If the script helps, you'll be back in the game in no time. And that's it! One of these solutions should fix peak, not launching or crashing on your PC. If this tutorial helped, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and share it with a friend who needs it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.